Wanted talks. In this video, we will talk about how you can become a web designer and a web developer at the same time. These days, company want full stack employees like uh, they, they want you to work as a web designer and a web developer. So being a designer and a developer specifically is not enough to grow in your career. Now, uh, in this uh, video, we will talk about both. But specifically, we will talk more about the web dis web development. If you want to work concurrently and you have a good knowledge about Photoshop, like you can see here, I am playing with the layers and uh, developing this logo for my channel. This is Wanted Talk logo. And I am creating the animation using Vegas or I am using the Coral Draw or Adobe Illustrator. These tools are the for front end, not for the front end, for the web designer. You are designing some image or graphic and you are giving to a developer. But if you want to also be a developer, then you must have uh, the knowledge about these technologies like HTML, CSS and JavaScript. You can see the funny image here. So if, if you want to be a part of development, then uh, you must understand about these three. Th these are very important. And JavaScript is uh, a kind of programming language is is an interpreter language. Actually, it is used to manipulate the DOM and HTML and CSS by using these. You will create the DOM. Now, first we will understand what is DOM. DOM is document object model, which is created. Suppose you write any HTML and uh, you open it in a browser, which you can see here. If you will inspect it and you can see here you will see here a structure it is a tree like structure and which is in xml form and body are separated so it is a tree like structure you can see in this image it is creating like this so uh i mean to say is uh, like whether you are writing the html or css or you are using javascript to add on the functionality in your uh web development part then you must understand about the dom html and css create this dom which you can see here and uh, javascript is to manipulate the dom it uh, how it happens we will see in the further videos of uh, which i have uh, make separately of html css and javascript you will understand them better but how what to learn uh, this video is all about now here you will not uh, develop the static graphics. Now you will develop uh, the scalar vector graphics, which you can see an example here. This is a part of HTML5. So you must know about these things because if you will create an image, it, it takes uh, um, much of size. If you will create a HD and a big size image, it have a lots of details. But if you create a SVG, a scalar vector graphic, then it is scalable and it takes very less memory. It is very clear. And now companies are using these kinds of graphics. So uh, forget about I, I don't recommend forget about Photoshop or that kind of designing. But companies are also working on this to develop the logo. So to understand them better. You can see my further videos when I will talk about these, but uh, I am giving you the overview to become a developer, what you need to know. And uh, apart from this, uh, the canvas, canvas is uh, the graphics. Like if you have uh, seen the Google maps that is based on the JavaScript. So these images are dynamic. Uh, coming back uh, to the HTML, HTML is the basic, basic structure of the website. You can make it responsive. You must have a good knowledge about the HTML tags. CSS is for the presentation. You can see here the list of the properties and how to use in detail. We will talk later, but these properties are can make any graphics which we do in Photoshop. We can do here. We can give the shadow. We can uh, like uh, give the border or uh, the gradient in the text or making the shapes everything is possible using canvas is html5 and uh, scalar vector graphics which you can see here so you you have a you need to have a good knowledge about html html5 and css and css3 which have the latest properties uh, which can develop a graphics or a better website JavaScript is an interpreter language, uh, which is uh, the only front end 
a kind of programming language uh, and it, it do not compiles like java and it is easy to learn actually this is a call you do not need any library to execute javascript code if you can see here i can give you an example uh, like i am inserting a alert here so you can see uh, like i am not uh, using any external thing browser can understand html css css and javascript without adding any any third party plugin or any library or cdn you can say content delivery network now here how you can learn javascript better we will see here now we are we can see here like we are calling the document by the id which we are passing in html tag so how these things are happening you need to understand all this flow so if you want to be a developer and you want to learn all this you can watch my further videos and uh, if you like this video and the difference uh, between the web designer and the developer then you can subscribe my channel thanks for watching the video have a good day